time has come for us to witness a once in a 75 year hatching of the elusive Ferratorto worm. When it finally awakes, it mates with and eats all it sees. The time has come! Nature! It's all around us. It's above our heads. It's below our feet. It's crawling around in our body hair and requires special shampoo to be destroyed. Mother Nature can be found hiding around every corner and in every crevice, just waiting to be discovered. Let's find that mother. Hello and welcome to the Unnatural History Show with me, Ross Noble. I'm here at this incredible location, which, for obvious reasons, we must keep secret. This will be my home for these broadcasts, but I'm not alone. My co-host is somebody who is not only an expert on the area, but whose family have been the traditional custodians of this place since the dawn of time. Please will you welcome Professor Shania Cottle. <sighs> ah, now if I'm not mistaken, that's a traditional greeting in your culture, isn't it? So, uh... <sighs> Let's stop that there, otherwise the, uh, the viewers are going to think that there's a gas leak. <laughs> well, you're very welcome and uh, thank you for coming along to uh, impart your wisdom. Perhaps you'd like to tell me a little bit about this area. Hey, perhaps you'd like to tell me with words rather than like whatever that was there. The time has come for the dominion of man to crumble, for my kind to rise once more. For a thousand years, we have been the keepers of this realm, and the human race will soon see the power of real magic. Okay, well, uh, that's, that's wonderful. Well, uh, the main reason we're here is hopefully to witness the hatching of the elusive Ferratoto worm, a truly once-in-a-lifetime spectacle We've located ourselves as close to the hatching zone as we safely can, and our state-of-the-art cameras will hopefully bring you this amazing worm right into your home. We have here, I believe, an arts impression of uh, what we think the worm looks like. Now, uh, looking at this little fella, he looks about, uh, what, 10, 20 centimetres? Four. Four centimetres. Meters. What? The legend of the Ferratoto has echoed across the centuries. The sleeping beast wakes from its slumber after 75 winters in an irascible rage. It will stop at nothing to gouge on the flesh of all it sees before mating with its prey and allowing its quarry to impregnate it with energy. What? The body falls into the grave it dug as it hatched and the process begins again. Oh. All right. Well, uh, what a truly remarkable and it seems dangerous creature. Uh, we have some footage here of what we believe uh, is the only time the Ferratoto worm has been filmed. Once more, the circle is complete. Um, we're very close to the hatching area there, which is, um, which is nice. Um, I can't wait to follow the progress of this historical hatching. I'm sure all of you at home feel the same way. In our next instalment, I'll be showing you our state-of-the-art cameras that will be capturing the event. I have serious reservations about this. I am not trained for this. Get it back, get it back on us. My thanks to the professor. Seriously, I am not happy about this. The beast must be appeased. You at home can join in the conversation on social media if you have any questions or comments, and I'm sure you do. We would love to hear from you. Drop us a line and say hello. All that. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>